there, my name's Scott. Today I'm going to be doing a uh, review on a, uh, it's called a classic pen style and it's a model DSC 801. Uh, here it is. Uh, but it's one of a, a bit of a difference because it's got a long cable attached to it. So it's got a USB pass through rather than the battery. Uh, so as you can see, it's actually connected into my uh, laptop computer there. And basically what it does, it just gives it a constant power. So you've never got to worry about the uh, batteries running down. You know, you get a uh, constant current going into it. So every time you take a drag on it, you're getting the perfect hit. So I'll just show you, uh, take it apart and show what it is. You've got your cartridge there, which uh, the cartridges on these are absolutely ginormous. You then have your atomizer. And then you have the... Uh, it's called a battery, but I don't know if it actually has contains an actual battery inside. Like I said, you know, you've just got a, ca a cable going into it, so it's just giving it a constant current. So you just, all it does is just uh, all uh, screws in together. And the cartridge pops in the top now. As you can see, looks wise, it looks very nice. It's a um, stainless steel, got the black mouthpiece, and it's got the black band on the, uh, on the atomizer. And obviously a black cable. It's got the LED still on the on the end there, so you can see that when it lights up, when you take a drag. So I'll just uh, go ahead and show you what the vapor's like on it. And as you can see, it really does kick out the vapour. Uh, loads of it. Uh, throw hit wise, it's a very strong throw hit. Uh, I've tried it with some various juices from sort of uh, the lowest I've got is about 11 milligrams up to the 36 milligrams. 36 milligrams used with caution because it really will sort of, you know, blow the back of your throat off there. Uh, the vapour itself is lovely and thick, plenty of it as you can see. Plenty enough to be able to do um, nice smoke rings with, got plenty of weight behind them. Uh, that's sort of one of the ways I normally sort of judge how much vapour is produced just by how long the uh, a smoke ring will sort of stay in the air. And uh, you know, again, this is you know, it's pretty much like a cigarette really, so it's pretty good in that sense. Um, with this one, I'm like, uh, I didn't, didn't actually come in the kit, so I can't sort of show you all the, like, what I normally do with a like, what's in the box sort of situation. But um, I went on to the, uh, the website www ecigs.co.uk and on there like they had it all for sale but it's uh, all separately so I just got myself the uh, got myself the uh, the pass through battery got myself the atomizer and uh, just a, a couple of blank cartridges um, so I can't comment on the taste of the cartridges like I said they're just blank so basically just means that you, uh, you get some like juice like this and then you just uh, fill it up yourself uh, the cartridge wise like I said at the start of the, uh, the recording I'll get it out uh, they're, they're massive, like compared to the what I'm used to uh, having. I'll just put on the macro mode, you might see a bit clearer. But you, uh, you can see there, they're, they're pretty big, really. And normally, I like I, I quite like my super minis, and uh, the cartridges on there, I think you get about sort of I don't know about sort of seven drops of uh, liquid in there. But like these ones, uh, they take about two and a half mil of your bottle. So if you buy a I'm not sure what size bottle this is. I think this is a, uh, a 10 mil bottle or 15 mil bottle. But you know, if you're filling up a few of these cartridges, one of these bottles won't actually sort of last you too long. Now you would have thought also, because of the cartridge, and of course it does, um, you know, end up you putting so much juice in it. You think that the cart would last you a hell of a long time. Uh, like normal sort of super mini carts last me probably about sort of the equivalent of like sort of five cigarettes before they need sort of topping up or refilling. Uh, so I expected these, because they're about sort of, three times the size, obviously give me about sort of, 15 cigarettes worth. But it's, it's almost sort of the opposite. It's quite a, uh, I mean, if you're looking at it in the sort of, term of uh, a car, you've got the super mini, that could be like your like, little one litre reliable run around. It's going to do hundreds of miles to the gallon. This is like the Land Rover, which is just a constant gas guzzler, basically. And uh, you put in juice in it, and it's... Um, you know, it's going straight to the atomizer, and like I said, you, know, you can tell by the amount of vapor that's produced by it 
know, that, that's the reason why. Uh, so you will find that you're sort of you're topping it up quite often, but then you know you're getting so much more vapor, you're getting that much more of a throw hit. Everything about it is uh, is great. Um, the only thing that like, sort of looks wise that I wasn't too overly too keen on was the uh, the black band around the atomizer there. I think it would have looked a lot nicer if it had been all completely silver. Um, it has got a, uh, a bit of a strange cut off. It seems to be quite quick. When I normally they're about sort of like five seconds, but I'll just see if I can get it to go now. I'm, I'm making it about three seconds. Let's just uh, see. I'm making it just over three, three of the bits all seconds. That's just by counting like one one thousand, two one thousand in my head. Um, normally that would really bother me, really sort of, uh, you know, grate on me a little bit because I like to take a nice long drag. But the fact is that you don't need any longer than that to be able to get like that amount of vapor. So that's like it's also a positive thing. Um, again, like you know, you can see that it flashes at the end now. And that's to show you that the um, like you've reached that cut-off period, but there's no sort of cut-off at all. Uh, so a lot of some of the e you know, once you go past that sort of like you no know, drag limit, then uh, the whole thing will sort of shut down for a minute or two to basically like cool down the atomizer. But this way, you can go straight away as soon as you get it. Um, topping up wise, like you can either just obviously just re refill your carts like you'd normally do, or they're pretty good for dripping directly as well. Now dripping directly, so you pull out the uh, the cartridge, uh, get some juice. Like the atomizer, the actual still with the atomizer is right down the bottom now. You got a nice wide opening, so it's pretty easy to just uh, drip some liquid straight into there. Again, you only need like this is already sort of fill up at the moment, but I'll just show you. I don't need to do this really at the moment anyway but just a little, literally a couple of drops in there and then you put your cartridge back on and that's it you're good to go and that should uh, say if you didn't have a cartridge in there at all or no juice in your cart there and you just want to direct drip sort of totally I reckon about well my estimation you're about some two two drops of uh, juice in there, that'll give you about sort of, one cigarette's worth of vaping before you start noticing that the actual vapour starts sort of, diminishing. It's a uh, really nice smoke. It looks great. I love the finish on it. Like I said, the only thing that's sort of not that overly keen on is the black band there. If that had been maybe a uh, a gold or just a continued silver, then you know, it would look the nuts. Uh, well, it still looks great anyway. Um, can't really sort of say anything negative about it. Maybe I'd like the call to be a little bit longer. Um, like say if I, uh, I don't know, didn't have my laptop with me and I was going to go on my uh, Xbox 360, you know, it'd be nice to be able to sit in the sofa with a bit of a longer cord and uh, add that plugged into the Xbox and so I can have a uh, Friday night vaping session and uh, chuck in a few games as well. Um, that's about it really, that's all I can really tell you about it. So if, you know, if you're interested in getting one, go to uh, www.e6.co.uk. Uh, if you type in this um, this code there, that'll give you a 5% discount on any purchases over £30. From the, uh, so thank you to the uh, guys from E6 there for giving us that. Um, Marks out of 10, well normally I sort of just mark things out of 10 just straight away, but um, just on the basis of how much I like it, so I'm going to do it a bit different now, um, start doing it on like the amount of vapour produced, so vapour produced it is a, well it's got to be a 9 out of 10, uh, looks wise, it looks great, uh, 8 out of 10, so that's uh, 17, and uh, the throw hit, well that's got to be a 10 out of 10, so that's 27 out of 30, so uh, my rough maths would be probably about, Eight and a half, nine out of ten. Uh, so great little, uh, well, great big e sig. Um, go and get yourself one. Thank you for watching. Uh, hope you enjoyed the review and uh, happy vaping. See ya.